This clip is brought to you by SaveWithConrad.com. Yeah. All right, uh, so here, here we see. This is last Thursday, a public workout. Look at the crowd here, dude. An incredible crowd. This goes to show you where the interest in this was. Shawn Michaels caused quite a scene here because the fans were loud and raucous. So this is the era where, thanks to you guys, fans thought it was okay to throw things in the ring. Well, somebody threw, I believe it was a battery, and hit Shawn Michaels. And he said, Yikes. fuck this, I'm out of here. And he went and got back in his car, and he wrote, or the limo. And he wrote about the fact that he was not coming back out and people were trying to come and talk to him. And eventually they coerce him to get out, but not before he has a handful of pills and, uh, guzzles a bunch of booze and then gets out there and does it and does the big photo op. And they got the, the big moment they wanted the big shot with, uh, him and, and Tyson kissing Austin's head was they sort of shoved the, the belt in his face, but it was, uh, it's a cantankerous situation with him in WWE. And man, look at all of the, the events surrounding WrestleMania. And this is before WrestleMania really, really blew up in right. terms of, you know, well, we've got multiple days of access. We've got NXT and we've got a hall of fame and I stadium mean, shows. Yes. Yeah. And here comes Takamichi Noku who Takamichi Noku. Thank you for saying it real. It's, it's okay. one of. Bruce Pritchard's favorite finds, the things he's most proud of in WWE. Yes, that's not a rib. This is something he's really, really excited about. He's going to be taking on uh, Aguila. Or Aguila. Aguila. I forget how they say his name here because they, they had this guy in a few different gimmicks. You've probably seen him three or four dozen times on shows we've covered here. But uh, yeah, there he is. My God, is it. Uh... Is that Hooventude? <laughs> oh my God. What is wrong with you? It's well, it, it's either Hooventude or it's, uh, uh, I don't know who it is. Well, he was probably better known. You've seen him as Papi Chulo and S.A. Rios and, um, Oh, I popped a Chulo before. Did you? Yeah. Well, that's cool, man. You know, what's crazy is this thing is what'd we say? 20. 23 years ago, 22 years ago, 22 years ago. Yeah. This, this homie is 41 years old now. So he What's was, the, he was the, uh, Mr. Mr. Aguilera. Oh, uh, Aguilera. No, no wow. I, I was, I was making fun of Christina Aguilera. Okay. But I'm just saying S.A. Rios, Poppy Chulo. He's, he's, he's 20 here, bro. This is their Ray Mysterio. Y'all baseball slide drop kick. You know what he should have, you know what he should have done? Uh, no, a uh, suicide. that's right. How about the moonsault off the top rope, bro, to the floor? What a big, spectacular move that would have been at any time in history, including here. I mean, now it's just Wednesday, but back then, holy shit, that was a big move. Yeah. You know, but, the uh, the fans still pop for it. Of course they do. I, they, they, uh, the, 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 AW fans, when a guy gets up top like that, they expect it and they love it every time they're ready for it. Yeah. It just it just shows you really this is this is a this this is a good uh, indicator of how wrestling has changed over the years and how what they're doing now is kind of more of what we're seeing. Here he goes, top tope suicida. Oh no, top rope. Wow. I don't know all the words. I don't either. I wish Excalibur was here. But well, we both do. Oh. Oh really? Well, well yeah. Yeah. Well, I wish uh, Megan Megan uh, Flair Thompson was here. No, you She's don't. a much more pleasant person to talk to. No, you don't. Than you. Oh, hey, you know uh, what? Uh, I want to I want to start using some of these words, but I know I'm going to screw it up. Yep. So should we just make shit up and just go with it? Well, that's how it happened, right? Okay. I mean, look. Let's be honest. Someone first said tope suicida right someone first said moon salt moon salt so is a legit made was, up word though what moon salt is a legit made up word right right so everything that we say has been made up so you know we could make up our own shit we could come up with our own language there's a flog frog frunum flop over the top Fernum snavitz yeah a snavitz 
and a gimmick snavitz what well, when did the and words, a kizay fizay watch out on the tizop when did uh snavitz become a thing in wrestling i don't know I, Bruce is it's one first, of my favorite words though Snape Bruce says. is the first person I've ever heard say it but I've heard Taz say it and a lot of other guys in recent years and I'm like man it's when did this thing become a thing it's a WWE thing it, I never heard it until I started working for Vince and he, he was dropping that Fernand Schnavitz on you well uh, Pat Patterson would in meetings use the word just to make people laugh holy shit that's a top rope tope suicida Spinning flop burn them a snake shit con right he, there. Con Hilo. Con Hilo. Con Hilo. It's a hell of a move, buddy. I ain't no doubt about that. Yeah. It's such a hell of a move that the fans didn't really didn't react to it like I thought they should have. They were like, oh, what the fuck? You know what? You can't go anywhere without Bill after, can you? There no, he is. He's everywhere, dude. Sucking everywhere. Oh, fuck. There's a Furnum flop. A Furnum and there's flop. a Moonsault springboard. One, two, three. A Furnum flop. Oh, man, I beat him. No, you didn't. So this kid, this uh, Hakamushi Shaki. His, his uh, name is Takamichinuku. Takamichinuku. Uh... He uh, really didn't become a big star, though, did he? Yeah. He did? Yeah. I mean, he's at WrestleMania. Okay, I got that. But, I mean, he's not Jushin Thunder Liger. No, it would have. He, he, and listen, he has had a great career. He's still wrestling. He started In New his, Japan? He started his own promotion. Yeah, he's done everything. I mean, okay. he, he's had a big career, whether you watched it or not. I mean, you didn't even know Shawn Michaels. You know, so whatever. I did know Shawn Michaels. I worked with Shawn Michaels. Never saw any of his stuff. Chop rope Frankensteiner. See Frankensteiner. And, yeah. and yes, he's, he's with new Japan for wrestling. Mm -hmm. Do you remember old Jennifer flowers, Jennifer flowers? Uh, yeah. Didn't she, uh, didn't, didn't, wasn't that one of the, uh, the women that, uh, the president Bill fucked Clinton. in the oval office. No, but okay. B he, Bill Clinton was accused of doing sexual things with her. But not while he was president back when he was governor. Uh, anyway, she is going to be in the next segment, which is going to be dated and stick out like a sore thumb, but it's coming up. Okay. Really good match here. That is probably underrated yes, yeah. by Meltzer. He only gave it a half a star. He really? Said, he says there were great flying moves, but Aguila needs to go to wrestling school, except for his amazing flying ability. He's a lot worse than a lot of people in their first pro match. Luckily, this was just meant as an exhibition of spots, and it was that, but it paled a comparison with the worst lucha matches in WCW. Aguila, who actually turned 20 at the end of last year, and they still call him 19, opened with an incredibly high moonsault off the top rope to the floor. Uh, anyway. Mm, there it went. So Taka did about as good a job as possible steadying the match, but it was a bad idea that couldn't be saved. Well, what about that belt? I think it's a turd of a belt. What do you think? Yeah, it is a turd of a belt. It looks stupid. It, it just, it's real, looks thin, flimsy, and looks like it was like, okay, uh, here's $10, build us a belt. Seriously. It looks like one they would sell in the concession stand or in the uh, merchandise shop. Yeah, it looks like something that marks like Super Dave would, would get and wear around their pond water. Did you know that Super Dave has a theory that he is he is safe from coronavirus because he drinks pond water? Well, he, he may he may be ahead of the curve. You know, you just never know. His nickname in our group chat is now Pond Water Jones. <laughs> You've never included me in this group chat. You don't want to be in there. Okay, good. I mean, you hate social media. Half the tweets you send out are from Dave Silva. Hey, hey, it's Conrad Thompson. Thanks for checking out the podcast here on YouTube. Be sure to hit the subscribe button and the notifications bell so you get a notice anytime we upload some new content. And go save yourself some money right now. If you're in a 30 year loan or you have credit card debt, it's not a matter of if I can save you money, it's a matter of how much. Find out right now for free at SaveWithConrad.com.